Hello and welcome to Toto TCG. You are here with me, Matthew, and we are back here with another Pokemon Twilight Masquerade on the channel. And in today's video, what are we going to be checking out? Well, that is a great question. And we're going to be taking a look at our final product from the set release, which was our single blisters. So in this opening, we have got Toxel, we have got Pupitar, we have also got our sort of evolution lines of Porygon Z, and of course Kingdra as well. So four different types of blisters that we're going to open today, 12 packs in total here, so only a third of a booster box, so it kind of makes up for the triple blister, so you know, it's almost like a seventh booster box, but what can we get from these? Now these can be very hit and miss, but the hits can sometimes be extremely good, so we'll have to see here. So. Without further ado, I'm going to get into it, we're going to open all of these up and we'll be right back when they're all open. So let's get to it and hit some music. Here we go. So here we are with our 12 blisters all opened up and ready to go. Now, of course, that does mean that we have an absolute out... We've pr pretty much got an outbreak of <laughs> LeChonk coins. Uh, <laughs> and it does look really cool, to be fair. It's got a bit of a bronzy look, but in the sort of light, it might look a bit like a normal golden coin, which is quite nice. But we do have 12 of these LeChonk coins now. So, uh, plenty, plenty of LeChonk to choose from, but uh, yeah, happy with that one. Be interesting to see what our next one will be as well, so that's always good to see. Now, we're going to do something a little bit different here, because obviously we've got all the different promos here, but what we're going to do is we're going to just take out random one pack, keep the promo where it is, and see what the pulls are. So anything that's sort of not a hollow, we'll put, put a hollow next to it, and just sort of see what happens, just so we can sort of randomise it. So, without further ado, let's get cracking. I'm going to start with this horsey. We won't make our way from left to right and then down the left to right, but let's just see what we can get from this first pack here. From horsey, is there anything, or sorry, should I say Kingdra, in this pack? Here we go. We've got a Snorlax, oh actually let's, I'll tell you what, let's bring this down a little bit. We've got a Snorlax, a Sea King, and it's going to be a Tinglu with a matching energy. So it can have a Tinglu and a matching energy there. So nothing from that one uh, particularly. We're going to have to keep going in and out here. Uh, let's try this Pupitar right here. Of course, I'm being stupid here. We've gone straight in without actually having a little look at these promos. Got an awesome looking Pupitar, looks a bit like a rocket coming out of the dirt. And a very cute looking Toxel at night with some little grassy bushes as well. Very, very awesome indeed. They'll all get sleeves as well once uh, once this is finished. Just to uh, save some time for all of you. Alright, here we go. Let's have a little look at this next one then. So, Pupitar is going to provide us with... It's going to be a Tangela, Trimeco, and it's going to be a Walking Wake, again with a matching energy. Okay, fair enough. Matching energy there. Interesting. Little plus there. Right, where are we going next? Let's go with this Porygon over here. So the Porygon is taken from Paradox Rift, and so is the Kingdra, just in case anyone wanted to know. Alright, let's have a little look and see what this one is doing. Here we go, we've got Sandy Gast up next. We do have something in this one. Let's see what we have though. We've got ourselves a Diflin, a Heatran Reverse, and it's going to be an Iron Fawns EX. Alright, no matching energy on that one, but that's all good. 
There we go, Iron Thorns EX for the Porygon Z. First pull out of our 12 packs here being an Iron Thorns EX. Alright. Nice! Okay, what are we going to do next? Let's do this Toxel down here. Alright, so we go, pop that off to the side, and there is our pack right here. Let's bring this down again. Alright, Tangler has got... We have got a Thwacky as our reverse, Snorunt reverse, and a Ting Lu as well as our Hollow. So, Hollow Ting Lu can go there, and then Energy off to the side as well, back up. Okay, where do we go now? Um, let's go for another Toxel, we'll go here. To your mask pack. Okay, off to the side, and we're going back down again, here we go. Alright, we've got ourselves an Applin on the front of this one. Applin has got, it's got a Reverse Poltergeist, Reverse Chimchar, and it's going to be an Enamorous as the Hollow there for the Toxel, so nothing in that Toxel pack. Alright, cool. Let's have a little look at this Pupitar over in the corner here. Another Teal Mask. Let's see what we've got in this one then. Bring this back down. Alright, here we go. What have we got then? We have got Feebus on the front, following that by a Swarner into a Diplin. Diplin Reverse into a Polyrath. And it's going to be a hollow frostlass as well. So that hollow frostlass can go in with the pupitar. There we go, back up. Okay, where do we head to next? Let's go with the other Porygon. Let's get that one out of the way. See if that was the only pull with the iron thorns. Let's see. Has Porygon got anything else hiding? Let's see. So back down again, we've got Seeking starting us off. Moving into reverse of an Applin, then a nose pass, and it's going to be a Chandelure Hollow. So it seems like it might have been a one off there with the Porygon Z. That's all good. All right, where's the pull? Where's the pulls? Uh, let's go this Pupitar here. Another to your mask. Come on, let's get one good pull. Oh no, 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 oh no. Can you see that? My reverse has got a, if that, that better not be an illustration rare. Oh dear, oh dear, what do we have? Okay, let's see, did the roller destroy something? Let's have a little look. Did we get lucky with that one? Caretaker as our first reverse. Oh no, we've got a Crypt Probopass! <laughs> and an Infernape Hollow as well. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, he's got crimping. Look at him. He's. I mean, a good thing is we have already got this one, but he's got crimping on the top. It's got, oh, that actually, that is a pretty nice texture to be fair. That little, I don't know what that was. Whether that got picked up on camera, I don't know. I don't know. But a probe will pass nevertheless. That is very unfortunate though that it got uh, a little bit destroyed there. The Pupitar with a probe will pass and Infernape there. So we are going to go over to this Toxel now. Okay, so we've had Illustration Rare. We've had an EX. Should we maybe aim for a fuller or better? Let's see. Maybe we get lucky. Let's see though. We've got Abra. Teleport us to the goods, come on. Ogre's Mask into a Dreepy and a Subian uh, Arcanine into a Walking Wake there. So only hollow so far from Toxel. Will that be how it ends for it? Well, I guess we'll find out. Uh, let's do this Kingdra. Let's finish the Kingdras off. The Evolution line with the Sinistra there. All right, let's pop this over here. And bring this back down. All right, we start with an Applin. Does this pack have anything in it? Let's see. We've got something. Oh, we potentially got a full art here. Okay, all right, okay. Let's see, though, what we have in this one. We've got a Mighty Anna to start things off. Come on. Mighty Anna into Daramaka. 
Now I saw a blue shoulder, which might mean that we've got another Lucian? Yeah, there we go. Cool. Alright, we called that one. Uh, it's not a blue shoulder, it was the blue book, but Lucian, full art right there. Into Grass Energy, of course. Very cool, so that's an EX, a full art, and an illustration rare. There's only one more thing to possibly come by, which is going to be quite hard with just two packs left on the board. But let's find out. Who do we go with? Let's go Toxel. Let's see if we can get anything from Toxels at all. Sinister here. Let's see if we've left the last one until the best one until last, should I say? Not the last one until best. Right, here we go. What have we got then? We've got Heliosk into... It's going to be a Caretaker Reverse, a Lairon Reverse, and it's going to be an Infernape Hollow, unfortunately, so not going to have any pulls from Toxel. Avoid the Toxels. So far, these are faring better. Our little Evolution Line Blisters, as opposed to these, especially when you have a Crimped Probopass. Our last pack here is going to be a Teal Mask. Can we end on a high? That code has been chewed up and spat back out. My goodness me. All right, here we go. Let's have a little look. We've got a Glimmit at the front leading us to... Looks as if we might actually have something in this one. We may have a full art. Let's have a little look then. Let's bring this right back down again. All right. Oh, that's why. <laughs> I was wondering why the camera's doing it itself. Look at that. I'm not doing that. That is so weird. Will you go back down? Are you good? Are we good? Okay. No, we're not good. <laughs> the camera is being annoying. Stop. Stop. Oh my god. Are you good? We're good. We're good. Okay. <laughs> That was weird. All right, Chansey Reverse. What have we got here then? We've got Chansey going into a Sand Slash, and our final pull of this opening is going to be... Oh! <laughs> it's still haunting us. The Dragapult EX Full Art. Again! Wow, okay. Very interesting, because that means we managed to get a full play set of regular Dragapult and three full arts. And that's the only artworks you can get from this thing. And this is the most valuable card as well, so that is incredible stuff. Getting that from one of these as well is really good. Really, really good. But there we go. There is our 12 packs all open there. So what do we end up with? We got a full art trainer, full art Pokemon, an illustration rare and an EX. So four for 12. Not too bad, actually. Very, very interesting. Um, is this playing up again? Yep, it's playing up again. Look at that. I, I'm not doing this. Okay, we're good. Uh, <laughs> right. So, I was saying in our, um, in our last booster boxes, just to double check, because I wanted to just see whether we got all of the A specs, and it turns out we actually did. So the A specs were Hyper Aroma, which we only got one of uh, in, a, in the case. Then there was also the Scoop Up Cyclone, the Secret Box, Survival Brace, Unfair Stamp, and Legacy Energy. So there was only six. I thought there were seven. So it means we got all of those, which is really, really cool. Just wanted to uh, let you guys know about that. But yeah, overall, very, very interesting. Please do not. There we go. <laughs> very interesting. So if you didn't already get your 12 Lechonk coins like I have now, um, you it, pretty interesting, you know, pull rates here. We got two matching energies here, but it seems like the better of the two. It seems like Pupitar was the better for us here, but also the the, the trio, the, the evolution line blisters as well. Toxel, forget about it. But if you have opened a Toxel, let me know if you've got anything more than four hollows. Or, you know, hollows when you opened it, because it'd be interesting to find out. But there we go. There is our last opening there for, of course, Twilight Masquerade. We will have... Uh, we might have a little a bit of a break, but you never know. We might be straight back in here with another Pokemon video with the tins, because we had tins that we opened along with this set as well, which I know will have a couple of Twilight Masquerade packs in, so we might get lucky with those. But... 
Apart from that, I will leave it here for this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Um, and like I said, let me know in the comments below if you have opened any of these, what were your pull rates like? But apart from that, I'll leave it here, and I'll catch you guys in the next video on the channel. I'll see you then.